This is Endless with VGMechanica.com. Let's play Final Fantasy XIV. I've taken a bit of a break, as you noticed. It's been a while since we did an update. It's been a while since I did a Final Fantasy update. If you also have noticed, my character has not changed. Uh, this is because I have been taking a break from the game until some of the updates have come out. Uh, I means my connection's kind of bad. Well, no. I'm not sure. Regardless. Uh, so a lot has changed. So I was going through some of the notes just to see what was going on. Uh, and right off the bat, you probably noticed these little bars at the bottom of my screen. Apparently it's now telling me at all times how much experience I need to level, how many skill points I need to rank up. Uh, also, I've noticed that when you click on a menu, you get much, much quicker response. Where before it would take a few seconds for it to do what you needed it to do. Now it's popping right up. And they've changed some of the menus. attributes Let's see. action and traits where before it would take a while to have any of these loads now they're loading pretty quick and that's a really nice fix I'm, I, I approve of that uh, to test this out better I'm going to start a class I haven't played before um, and I decide I'm going to do an archer so we got to go back to town and buy a bow so No, I don't want to go there. Family. So, as usual, the menu is still in the same place. Just over there, or you can hit. Oh, just, oh, I'm still for map. Okay. And then teleport. I'm going to go to Ulda. Ooh, they made it super cheap. All the teleporting is much cheaper. But I notice I have 100 anima, where before it would max out at 200 anima. So that may be the trade-off. Things are cheaper, but you can you can only max out at so much. What else did I read they changed? It takes less experience points to get, or at least skill points, to get to rank 30. From what I saw, it looked like a significant change. Uh, there's supposed to be more mobs, or more ba uh, monsters populating everywhere. And we're just going to test this all out with the Archer class. Again, I've never played the Archer in this game even before I took a break. So I'm kind of learning as we go. Loading screens have been taking a little longer for me than usual. So we may just skip to when it loads. So see you in a second. Alright, everything's loaded up. Getting a little bit of lag issues here in terms of my frame rate just dropped considerably in City. Bear with me. Alright, where are we going? We are. You know, I'm not even sure who sells the bow. getting way more uh, system lag in game in the city than I used to. Give me a moment. I'm just gonna pop the recording off and go look up where bows are now. Alright, 4-7 on the map by a vendor named Johannes. Four. That's right. Okay, goes down. Alright, I think I got him backwards again. I always do that. Four, seven. Okay, so I'm at this, and they need me in Sapphire Exchange. So let's get to the Sapphire Exchange. M to pull up the map, uh, I and K, J and L to scroll around the map, which is what I was doing. as usual. Do 
kind of wish there were more random NPCs. I know they always, and I'm sure it would play hell with my system. It's already kind of bogged down. But I always think of Final Fantasy XI, where you have to weave through the crowds. All right, we gotta wait for the vendors to spawn. I was told they were supposed to reprioritize modeling loading, but maybe I just moved too fast and it's loading. <laughs> it's loading people way up there. Alright, someone behind me loaded. Oh. Pop, pop, pop on the map. There we go. Alright. There's Johannes. Let's see if this has sped up any. Alright, I didn't have to go to the interaction screen. Well, you need bows, uh, sorry, you need ammo for these. I'm gonna go ahead and equip it so I'm the new class. Probably unequip my, it'll unequip my shield automatically. Yeah. So let me go, so I'm now an archer, or a, yeah, an archer. Let's, uh, get our actions up. Click on, go into the menu, click on Actions. I'm obviously still a caster as well. Interesting. So now we're going to unequip my... like that. Oh, shoot, I just done. Okay, it's still very good. And then we'll get my healing spells because we don't want to die. And we'll, we'll live with that for now. I know they sell arrows. Oh, let's see some. I'm gonna skip ahead real Five four Zagel's word. Probably here. Okay. So we're gonna go around and get some arrows. I'm not like wearing optimal gear for an archer. I'm not worried about that mainly because. Mainly because I'm level, uh, I'm physical level 20, even though I'm archer rank 1, so I'm still going to have an easy time with all this. Dark out. Well, maybe not that dark, maybe dusk. sees a chance to pop. Active mode. Huh. <laughs> I appeared to be stuck in place. There we go. Kind of a big area it could be behind me for all I know. Several words, several words, several words. Worst case, I know they sell at the camp, but I hate. Uh here. 
I hate to get there and find out that they changed it or something. The door is opening like really fast. I mean, the first one I went through, but didn't have to stand there waiting for it. So much system lag. I'm gonna have to play with my settings before I do another video. Oh, come on. Okay. store I just kind of didn't check there if it's not here we'll just go get some leaf quests and go do some quests and hope and hope no Mel all right well we'll go get some quests and hope I feel all ghetto going around with damaged equipment, but I'm really not that worried about it. You know, we'll check on our, uh... We'll, we'll check on our salesperson. Retainer. Before we leave. Let's see how that all worked out. I'm not even sure we should do that. I'll have, I think I can summon her here, though. Oh. Waiting on the NPCs. The good news is they're supposed to load the NPCs before they load the other players, so at least they got priority over that. they've increased the rewards for the lower rank missions and uh, lowered them for the higher rank. Also, if you choose a difficulty that's too much for you in a leave quest, as you can go one through five stars, you always have the option to make it easier. Alright. All the way down to one star. So, if you bite off more than you chew and want to try it at five stars and it's just too much... Oop, I just tried to jump and it's just too much, uh, you can change your mind. So we're going to run out there and see if anything's changed outdoors. And as we leave the city, my performance improves. people are playing in the area. Ooh, it doesn't tell me anymore. They're really pushing hard to make this game, uh, better, I guess would be the word, before March for the PlayStation 3 release. So, pretty much most feedback people give them is looked at, or is it gone over and uh, considered. 
but never feel bad if you have a problem and you want to let them know at Squaresoft. Just email support, in-game or out. They seem to be working pretty hard to fix it. It's hard to tell if the spawn rate here is increased, as I don't see a lot of beginning players, as the game isn't new anymore, there aren't as many level 1s. Again, in March, that will change with the PlayStation 3 players joining us. Um, Squaresoft has gone, has kind of gone way uh, be above and beyond trying to make everyone happy. I mean, if you were part of the original group of people to start playing, um, I'm on my third free month. I have not paid for this game yet uh, in terms of the monthly subscription. So, that's awesome. They really want to make sure everyone's happy before they start expecting everyone to pay. No Momo! Arrows. What lots? Do a hundred. Well, that's not hundred. That's a hundred and eleven. Apparently. Okay. I'm okay with that. All right. We have acquired our arrows. So one thing I want to look at, and I haven't looked at, is if they fixed the inventory. Remember, it was a pain to go through. You couldn't sort it. Hey, you can sort. Uh, I don't know how to turn it on, though. I'll have to play with the options later. How many items do I have? Holy crap, you can hold 100 now, at least. Okay, what am I looking for? I was equipping arrows. So you go click on gear. This is your pack. It's where, arrow, it's where ammo for anything goes. Bait or whatever. And that should do it. We should be good. Escape to get out. Now let's go start a quest. Something else uh, I believe they've done is you get experience on successful kills. So it's no longer it's no longer based off of kind of luck. That should be fine. Sorry. It's no longer based on the luck of the draw, like where a random hit would kind of get what you needed it to, but... There they are. Mission targets still have the little scroll next to their head. Or a sheet of paper or whatever. Okay, let's grab one.
I, I ranked up. So close shot is supposed to bind them, and then you're supposed to be able to back up. Okay, that seems to be working. He's stuck in place. Ranked up twice. <laughs> Holy crud! Wow, that is a ton of skill points. I don't know... Close shot. Get him in place. Maybe. Rank four! Wow. Got an ability, we'll play with it in a bit. I am very pleasantly surprised at how fast I'm ranking up here. to target that time and it actually worked it didn't target me first so I'm kind of happy with that okay that took us to rank 5 already holy crud completely okay with that. Man, they're really gonna just shove you through these beginning uh, leave quests to put you into the level 10 spot. Rank 5, man. Slightly higher uh, note. We'll go to three. Commence, and we'll get some uh, aspect. Oh. Also, I got a new ability, so let's put that on real quick. What does this do? Alright, so let's move you out of the way here. I got that too, apparently. <laughs> That's pretty cool. We'll put the healing spell there. Leveling it high, my thermometer will be easier. I'll have to try it for the next video. Let's 
Sid High Driver. I wonder if I heard that name before. Alright. out a little more. <laughs> no worries. shot. And then we're gonna pin him. Gonna back off. And just start shooting up. Oh, fine didn't work. Oh well. And we're ranked six already. And I got another spell. just kind of does it passively. So, I mean, it's supposed to refill your quiver, but who knows? How many arrows do I have left? Sixty. Okay. I've gone through half the arrows already, so. I'll probably grab, like, as many as to let me next time. Ah, the sandstorms of the old dog desert. Alright. And I'm just hitting the numbers for these one to attack my main attack and then. Occasionally I throw in close attack to see if it actually binds them. And we're rank seven. Holy, I am liking that. Still auto loot, which is nice. When I did that uh, Warcraft video, it was something I sorely missed. Ow. 
gang attacks together. At this point. And we're rank eight. I guess he's become the mission spawn. Alright, and we did it! So, eight ranks and two missions, that's definitely new. They start giving you less skill points as you rank up, which makes sense. My theory, oh, there it is. Uh, I got a new short bow. I wonder if it's better than the one I got. So we'll take a quick look at it. I thought it said I got one. Oh, I think it's the same as the one I have. No worries. Alright, let's grab some more arrows. people out there. Looked like it took about 50 arrows a mission when you solo. And that's good to know. Probably if you have the the gill, just keep buying max arrows. Hey, it's a uh, Reddit. They, what happened was they changed the they shifted uh, the reddit link shell to a different one because I think the leader left and forgot to give oh, we're boomers buddies
just like usual, you can join uh, several Link Shells, and I'm glad this happened because, as you can see, not very many people on in Carmenites anymore. When the uh, leader left, we lost the ability to make more Link Pearls, so we can't invite anyone else to that one. So now I'm in the right Link Shell, and that's awesome. So I'll see them talking, and there's actually people that play in this Link Shell. So that was happy happenstance. Okay, so the chests may be open automatically. They do. I don't have to go to interaction for them anymore. I got 114 gil. So chests are tied to link shells, in case I never made that clear in the past. So they spawn for you randomly when you're doing a link shell. So let's go into active mode. And fire. Boom. All right. Oh, I forgot to set my new abilities. We'll do that after we kill these two. active mode. Maybe. F, please. Leave active mode. Thank you. Okay. And we're going to go check out our new traits. I'm not worried about that one. we got that one. It's a sword. Quite sure the difference is, but you know what? We'll give it a try. I have a sneaking suspicion what refill is. And if I could move it, I would, but whatever. We'll just put it shadow bind there. I think that'd be good for when you're gr solo grinding. You can get out of their range and stuff. So, okay. Back in active mode. All right, come on. straight to the next guy, so it's improved quite a bit. Alright, and we're rank 9. Awesome. I'm completely okay with that. Oh, I forgot to heal myself. Just that quick, we've done three missions. Come back. No. And 
hand. I've got one more mission, so let's do it. following the little quest helper build that's built into it. I'm killing that nut fighter marmot. It's a uh, particularly menacing name, especially because my character is male. We'll have to uh, protect his nuptials. Okay. Let's get in active mode. Take a few shots. Something else, according to the patch notes, is I guess before with the archer, you couldn't use any of the archer skills unless you had a bow. But now apparently they're allowing you to use some of the skills with thrown weapons. And because a lot of the melee classes can equip thrown weapons, that's actually pretty cool. growing groups. So not really a whole lot of point in kiting. less than an hour, we have started an all-new class, done four leave quests, and gotten to rank 10, which makes us uh, able to do the next level of leave quests. That's crazy. I like that change. You can get right into the game. It gives you a comfort area where you can figure out your character and your system and all your new uh, abilities, but you can just level like mad there. See, now we're ranked 10. We don't even need to be in this zone anymore. So, like, we can just move on to the next camp, or accept missions for it, and start doing all the 10 plus. That's pretty cool. Well... I approve of these changes. I really do. On the other hand, I miss my Thaumaturge. <laughs> so I think, well, I like the Archer. It was just to try out the new... The new changes, I'm going to... On the next video, we'll probably go back to my Thaumaturge and try out the higher level missions again, since he's uh, rank 14, I think. Wow, already rank 10. In less than an hour, you can get any class to rank 10 now. I find that impressive, considering their max rank is 50. I could teleport, but I want to run back.
I'm in the correct link shell now, and that makes me happy. Try to do the next video with Jimmy. Um, they've also been doing some Final Fantasy XI videos, which will get posted soon. Just the late game stuff to kind of show how the game in ended up. As far as I can tell, there's no auction yet. It's still all in the bazaar. Oh yeah, let's check on our retainer. Forgot to do that. I'm not quite at an hour yet. idea where she's at, so we'll just summon her at the uh, bell in here. Wow, rank 10 already. That's pretty cool. That was one of my kind of little qualms, how long it took to, to accomplish anything. But we just did that in an hour. Even a casual gamer could do this in no time. Most of the menu lag's gone, I'm still getting just a tad of it, but it's much improved. I thought I left her with stuff, I could have sworn I did. Oh, here we go. Okay. Okay. So apparently she hasn't sold anything in the time I've had a break, so no worries. Like she can hold more stuff too, though. That's nice. Gotta figure out how to sort, but we'll play with that later. Oh, that's cool. She's off doing her thing. Alright, uh, we're gonna call it here. Thanks for watching. I like, I'm very happy with the changes they've made. I'm, seems to have improved things quite a bit. I'm looking forward to what they do next. I still want an auction house, but I think we all do, but they'll get that. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, next time we'll go and we'll do the higher level missions. Uh, take care.